This is going to be the All Stars version of my previous video. Just a few recognizable objects um, and a lot of fun. So here we are with the first one. This is Darth Maul. He was found in a cereal packet and he's supposed to be a pen. But uh, he's got a little neodymium on his head. Oops. As you can hear. And there he is levitating. A bit dark, so I'll put the flashlight on him. There we are. Shine the light in his face. And there we are, that's Darth Maul in the air. Well, I'm sure every kid's got these little soldiers. And this one's wearing a neodymium hat today as he levitates. He's one of these super soldiers, I guess. Oh, there we are. An army chap levitating away. And this one didn't need any magnets on the top of the coil while he's so light. How about this for an oversized item? This helicopter was the very first flying anything that I bought in 2008 and it was last in the air about a year ago well until now again we don't need a magnet on the top of the coil because it's not very heavy at all but there is a small magnet there on the top of that uh, stabilizer bar there we are levitated and back on the ground. <laughs> Let's put him back. There we are. This Polycarpov plane is quite old too. It's a couple of years old. He used to fly around a desktop pole. Um, had the motor wires, I don't know if you can see them, underneath, connected connected up uh, to a power supply and around a pole it went it flew quite nicely, a bit fast but anyway so now it's uh, floating away levitating there we are And here's my pride and joy at the moment, a levitating Back to the Future DeLorean. Had to change the magnets on the top a little, I've put uh, a couple of different types. There's one inside the car as well because the car body isn't actually magnetic. But it's all worked out quite nice that one. And here are the All Stars all together. A lot of fun that. Okay, thanks very much for watching.